AM 13 News. A finer farewell to Fairfield Fire Chief Kevin Sutton, family, friends, and the city of Fairfield remembering the fallen first responder. Hundreds came together to lay Chief Sutton to rest after he tragically died in a car accident last weekend. WBTM 13's Larissa Scott on their final goodbye to a man who put his life online for his community. The sky shall unfold. Repairing his interest. Fairfield Fire Chief Kevin Sutton. He was just funny. He was good. He was caring. He was compassionate. And he left behind an entire community of people feeling his loss after he was killed in a car crash. We've lost, we've, we've lost a great friend and uh, City of Fairfield has lost a great leader. I never saw him with a frown on his face. Many people tell similar stories of the man he was. They broke the mold when they made Kevin. You know, it's few people that you can really say that he was a real positive person. A positive person with a heart of gold. Thank you for being my friend. A friend, a father, a husband, a brother, and a son. This has been a tough time for our family. Paying their final tributes to a man who gave them all so much. You left, you left him knowing that you had a friend now. And as Chief Sutton went for his final ride, he left them as a community forever changed. In Jefferson County, Larissa Scott, WVTM 13. And traffic shut down for several miles in Fairfield this afternoon with hundreds of people lining up to pay their final respects. Tonight, WVTM 13's Kira Powell takes a further look at Chief Sutton's final send off. Fire Chief Kevin Sutton's watch has been properly relieved. Five tones marking the end of more than 20 years of service. He stood his watch with pride, integrity, and devotion to duty. And today, hundreds of people were determined to show their devotion to Chief Kevin Sutton. His professionalism has brought distinction to himself and the Fairfield Fire and Rescue Service. Blocking off streets for miles throughout Fairfield from Bessemer Highway to MLK Drive, following Chief Sutton to his final resting place. <laughs> Saying goodbye to a man who loved well and who will be remembered fondly. Elmwood Cemetery, the final resting place for Fire Chief Kevin Sutton, with hundreds of people gathering today to pay their respects. Firefighters from departments all across Jefferson County were on hand to assist with today's burial. A flag flying at half staff over the cemetery, sending a silent reminder of the man lost. We spoke with Vanessa Car Carlisle, who knew Chief Sutton since high school, and she tells us though Sutton may be gone, he will never be forgotten. But everywhere that we look, we'll see Kevin. And every smile, every tear that we share, he's always in our hearts, an infectious smile, and he's made an indelible impression on us that we'll never forget. So his legacy will live on through us. Tomorrow marks one week since the 18-wheeler collision that claimed the life of Chief Sutton. His wife and daughter were also injured in that crash. Today, Miss Sutton is out of the hospital, but their daughter remains in critical condition. Brittany.